and welcome to our channel. My name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food, and I am here with a haul from Trader Joe's, one of my favorite grocery stores. I spent about $125 and some change, so let me jump right in. So I'll start back here with the produce. I got some kale. I just like to have kale on hand. I also use it for plenty of recipes as well. I also got some of my frozen French style green beans. Love these things. I usually just saute them with garlic and olive oil and seasonings. I also grabbed some parsley. Um, I've only recently, like within the past year and a half or st so, started cooking with parsley, and I love the flavor that it imparts on dishes. Grabbed some butter lettuce just for side dishes for dinner during the week. Grabbed some fresh corn. My husband loves corn, so I grabbed some for him. I also grabbed an avocado for him as well. They were very expensive, so I only grabbed one. This little avocado was $2.50. Grab some green shredded cabbage. I love cabbage. I use it in all sorts of things. I grabbed my husband some jerk plantain chips. I'm not a big plantain person, but these are really good. They have a good flavor, a nice little kick to them, and he just likes to snack on them. Uh, we both like peanuts, so I grabbed some of these peanuts. These are the really um, crunchy peanuts. So I grabbed a small bag until I can get to Costco and get the big container of peanuts. I grabbed some of this um, chicken chow mein, it's frozen. I like to have this kind of stuff on hand for quick weeknight dinners. I usually add some extra vegetables in it to kind of bulk it up a little bit. I grabbed my two-year-old son some smoothies. He likes the wild blueberry and the strawberry. Trying these out for the very first time. These are sour cream corn, I'm sorry. Sour cream and onion corn puffs. Never tried these before. Recently, I tried the white cheddar corn puffs from Aldi and I really liked them a lot, so I figured I would like the sour cream as well. Grab some orzo for recipes. Um, these peanut butter cookies are a new item. These are crispy, crunchy peanut butter cookies. They come in a little tub, and so here they are. I like peanut butter and I like crispy cookies, so I'm excited to try these out. These Kahlua pork spring rolls are also a new item. I've heard, um, you know, positives and negatives. Some people said that these are really smoky tasting, and so um, I don't know how I feel about that, but my husband and I, we both like pork, so I'm gonna give these a try. I love this pub cheddar, this sharp cheddar cheese. It's a, um, a spread, and so I usually just, when I want a quick lunch or something quick for breakfast, I'll just um, use this cheese on crackers, have some lunch meat or pickles with it, something like that. I recently tried this meat lasagna for the first time. It is really good. It's in the frozen section, and it does taste like homemade, a lot better than Stouffer's frozen um, lasagna to me. Very, very good. And I grabbed some chicken sausage. I bought this, I think on a recent haul, and I really like this chicken sausage. Pretty tasty, so I grabbed some more. I needed some canola oil. Grabbed one um, tube of jumbo cinnamon rolls. Now, um, I like these a lot better than Pillsbury. My husband likes them too. He's not a big fan of the Pillsbury cinnamon rolls, but we both like these jumbo Trader Joe's cinnamon rolls. rolls. Grabbed some pork and ginger soup dumplings and some chicken soup dumplings. These are very good. I got two pork and two chicken. These are good snacks or lunches during the week. Um, their blueberry muffin mix is new, so I grabbed some of that. And I love blueberry muffins. I usually get the ones from the blueberry muffin mix from Aldi. Um, the difference between the Aldi one and this one is that these come with freeze-dried blueberries and you have to rehydrate them, but this is what they look like. And then they also had a spring cupcake mix out too that I wanted to give a try. So it comes with white cupcake mix and then caramel chocolate candies, which are those little egg things on top. Then it comes with the frosting as well. I love these butter almond thins, so does my husband, a nice little treat for us. Trying out these um, soft and juicy mandarins for the first time. I like fresh mandarin oranges, 
and I've always been curious about these, never tried them, so I decided to give them a try today. Another thing that I've been curious about is this shampoo bar. So I've wanted to try that out, peppermint and tea tree, and it has uh, coconut, olive, and jojoba oil, so I'm excited to try that out. Um, also giving these turkey corn dogs a try. I can't remember if I've tried them or not. If I have, it's been a long time ago. But again, just a quick um, lunchtime, lunch meal for uh, me or my husband or my two-year-old if he's wants to give it a try. And then we really like these tarts. I try to get one every time I go. They're just a quick lunch for us. They are absolutely delicious. And then trying these cheese pastry rolls for the first time. From what I've heard, it has like a cream cheese filling, like a sweet cream cheese filling. So I wanted to give those a try. We are, um, I got another one of these pastas. I tried this for the first time, I think, my last Trader Joe's haul, and this was really good. So I said I wanted to have it in the freezer from here on out for quick meals. And then another one of my staple favorites are these mini croissants. Love these things, as you can see. I got two boxes of them. These are absolutely delicious, so. And I think that is everything that I grabbed on this Trader Joe's haul. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to give us a thumbs up. And if you have not subscribed to our channel, we'd certainly love to have you. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you all next time.